And so what was uh, President Xi saying yesterday? Well, we were talking mostly about the uh, the virus, and I think he's going to have it in good shape, but, you know, it's a very tricky situation. It's, uh, Indeed it, goes, it, it goes through air, Bob. That's always tougher than the touch. You know, the touch, you don't have to touch things, right? But the air, you just breathe the air, and that's how it's uh, passed. And so that's a very tricky one. That's a very delicate one. Uh, it's also more deadly than your, you know, your even your strenuous flus. You know, people don't realize we lose 25,000, 30,000 people a year here. Who, who would ever think that, right? I know. It's, I mean, much it's pretty forgotten. amazing. And uh, then I say, well, is that the same thing? For, this is uh, more right. deadly. This is 5 per, you know, this is 5% versus 1% and less than 1%. You know, so this is deadly stuff. Now it's turning out it's not just old people, Bob, which is today and, and yesterday. Some startling facts came out. It's not just old, older yeah, exactly. young people to plenty of young people. So you, what's going d- on in give France. me an, a, a moment of talking to somebody, going through this with Fauci or somebody who kind of uh, it caused a pivot in your mind because it's clear just from what's in on the public record that you went through a pivot on this to, oh my God, the gravity is uh, almost inexplicable and unexplainable. Well, I think, Bob, really, to be honest with you... Sure, I want you to I be. wanted to. Uh, I wanted to always play it down. I still like playing it down. Yes, sir. Because I don't want to create a panic. But let, let me ask you this. I mean, we share uh, one thing in common. Uh, we're white... Uh, privileged, who uh, my father was a lawyer and a judge in Illinois, and we know uh, what your dad did. And uh, uh, do you have any sense that that privilege has isolated and put you in a cave to a certain extent? Is it put me and I think lots of white privileged people in a cave, and that we have to work our way out of it to understand uh, the anger and the pain particularly black people feel in this country. Do you no, s- you, you really drank the Kool-Aid, didn't you? you? Listen to you, wow. No, I don't feel that at all. Do you it. think there is systematic or institutional racism in this country? Well, I think there is everywhere. I think probably less here than most places or less here than many places. Okay, but is it here? in a way that it has an impact on people's lives. I think it is, and it's unfortunate, but I think it is.